Happy Crackernoon! I'm Kat. I'm Julie. And thanks for joining us today. We are celebrating the colors of spring that you see. Whether it's the flowers that are growing or the blue sky, the white clouds, or the rainbow after the rain that we have in the spring. So pretty this time of year. Yes. Mm -hmm. So here's what you'll need. Yeah. Let's start with popsicle sticks. Yes. Oh, any size. And the popsicles are back in the stores, of course, so have mom buy you a pack of popsicles and sandy sticks. <laughs> craft sticks. <laughs> so for the, um, to create the rainbow colors, you'll need markers of all different colors of the rainbow. Some cotton balls or the fluffy clouds. And then you see ours has a cute little face. So you can have googly eyes, is what we used, or you can have scrap pieces of paper um, to cut out the eyes, make them any color you want to, or they could be black and to make a smile. Um, oh, you'll also need scrap pieces of paper to glue the sticks yeah. on to make sure they stay and just for stability. Yes, and then glue the, if you want to glue the cotton balls for the clouds mm -hmm. um, to keep those together. You don't have to do that. You can glue those right on the sticks too, mm -hmm. but you'll see what we have used the scrap piece of paper. So we're just going to uh, color some sticks a bit and, and go from there. Yeah, that's good. Okay, so grab your glue. Do a little zigzag fashion like the carpenters do. And we're going to talk about the colors. Um, you may have heard red goes first. Mm -hmm. Do that. So red, orange, yellow, green, indigo or blue, and violet. So we did our straight across, but I've seen it done kind of fun to maybe stagger the sticks a bit. If you wanted to do that, you could make it look like your rainbow's dripping down. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, but you do need to let it dry a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Next, we'll glue on our other scrap piece of paper to add the cotton for the fluffy cloud. And then you're gonna have fun with the cotton balls and just kind of spread them apart so you can press them down. You probably need two or three, you know, depending on how fluffy you want your cloud to be. I'm just gonna pull them apart. Your fingers might get a little sticky. <laughs> We used four. Yeah. Now for your cute little googly eyes. One and two. It'd be fun to use different size googly eyes. It's mm -hmm. a funny thing. And I am just gonna cut, you know, in the shape of a smile. So it's kind of a curve on top of another curve. Happy clouds <laughs> and a happy rainbow. Yeah. So thank y'all for joining us today. It's so fun to be with you again. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.